This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at the standard enthalpy change of combustion. So let's start with the definition. The standard enthalpy change of combustion is the enthalpy change when one mole of a substance is burned completely in oxygen under standard conditions. So here we have the equation for the combustion of one mole of ethanol in oxygen to produce carbon dioxide and water. The standard enthalpy change of combustion values for a range of substances can be found in Table 13 of the IB data booklet. For example, the standard enthalpy change of combustion value for ethanol is negative 1,367 kilojoules per mole. Note that all standard enthalpy change of combustion values are negative because combustion reactions are exothermic. Next, we look at how to calculate the enthalpy change for a reaction using standard enthalpy change of combustion values. So the enthalpy change of a reaction is equal to the sum of the standard enthalpy change of combustion values of the reactants minus the sum of the standard enthalpy change of combustion values of the products. So here we have the equation for which we'll calculate the enthalpy change. In this reaction, C2H4, which is ethene, reacts with hydrogen to form C2H6, which is ethane. In this table, we have the standard enthalpy change of combustion values for the reactants and products. Next, we input the values into the equation. So we have the sum of the enthalpy change of combustion values of the reactants minus the sum of the enthalpy change of combustion values of the products which gives us an enthalpy change for the reaction of negative 136 kilojoules per mole. In the next example, we look at a different method of calculating the enthalpy change of combustion. 2.90 grams of butane, which is C4H10, are burned in excess oxygen, releasing 143.5 kilojoules of heat. Using this data, calculate the enthalpy change of combustion of butane. The first step is to convert from mass in grams to amount in moles. So the amount in moles of butane is equal to 2.90 divided by the molar mass of butane, which is 58.14 grams per mole. This gives us 0.0499 moles. To find the enthalpy change for one mole of butane, we divide the heat released by the amount in moles of butane. This gives us negative 2,876 kilojoules. Note the use of the negative sign because the reaction is exothermic, which means heat is released. So the enthalpy change of combustion of butane is negative 2,876 kilojoules per mole. 